Hi guys, it's Sam Phillips here from R Marine Jones. Today I'm on board a 2008 Riviera 4400 sport yacht. With low hours and only two owners, this is one really worth looking at. Starting at the stern of the boat, we have a huge hydraulic platform here that's teak laid. Stainless steel rails either side for your bait board, your electric stainless steel barbecue, fender holders, rod holders. And this boat has snap davits on the back for your tender and a removable cable here which makes getting in and out of your tender nice and easy. We also have a large boot down the back, which is great for storing your chairs, your covers, life jackets, ropes. It has fresh water tap here for a hose down or a shower. This open plan cockpit is really appealing to the avid entertainer. You have a large lounge here with a table that can drop down, a fresh water hot and cold tap here, a bar fridge and an ice maker. Plenty of room for chairs for those extra guests. At the press of a button, the cockpit floor is raised, giving you direct access to the engines and the generator. Down here we have twin Volvo Penta IPS 600s, 435 horsepower each, approximately 350 hours at the time of filming this. Uh, we've also got direct access to your batteries, Karcher water maker, generator behind me here, and a step to get out. When Riviera introduced the hopper window to our sport yachts, it really changed the way we use our boats. It makes the cockpit and the saloon all feel like one area, and the person who's preparing the food in the galley makes them a part of the action. They're not tucked away down in a hole. Come on inside and we'll have a look at the galley. As you step in the main cabin door, we've got the galley here on the starboard side. It's got great bench space, a 240 volt two burner cooktop, microwave convection oven, dishwasher below, Fridge freezer in here, great storage for your cutlery and crockery. Adjacent to the galley, we've got the saloon. This is a nicely sized lounge, table that can drop down and fold in half. Towards the front here, we've got a TV that can also disappear when you're not using it, which gives you great vision around the boat. The helm station is situated forward and starboard in the saloon. You've got a Raymarine E120, a Muir chain counter, trim tabs, of course your Volvo Penta joystick, opening windows either side for fresh air and a sunroof above. As we step down into the companionway, we have a sliding cupboard here for your bottle storage and your glassware, as well as a large cupboard here for your linen storage and your washing and dryer machine. At the bow of your boat, you've got the master cabin. It's got a large island bed. It's got storage right around an opening deck hatch above for ventilation, a TV here on the wall, and your own private ensuite. This is the ensuite to the master cabin with a separate shower, vacuum flush fresh toilet, and a sink on the right. The aft cabin is really spacious. Because the Volvo Penta IPS engines are positioned in the aft, it really makes this room a lot bigger. You've got a large double bed here and a single bed here. So plenty of room for another family or the kids. You have an ensuite just forward here and your own TV. This head can be treated as the ensuite to the aft cabin or with access to the companionway can be treated as your day head as well. This concludes my walkthrough of the 2008 Riviera 4400 Sport Yacht. If you would like to see more of this boat, please contact me on 0403 515 78 and we can organise your own private tour through Skype or FaceTime. Thanks for watching.